Prior to importing an STL model, it is a good idea to select a preset that clearly shows the patient's anatomy. Using the bones or surfaces preset is recommended. An STL model can be imported by going to File, Import STL Model. Find the STL model on your computer and select Open. Similar to the previous version of Blue Sky Plan, the points functionality can be used to align the STL model. Select points and click the Align button. The software opens the CT scan of the patient's anatomy as well as the imported STL model. Normal mouse functionality can be used to rotate and zoom in and zoom out. Pressing the shift key turns on the placing points functionality and allows us to start placing points. Five points should be placed distributed throughout the models in locations that are easily identifiable in both models. When rotating or zooming, the shift button should be released to allow the normal mouse functionality to be used. Removing the last placed point can be done by selecting the undo button. Removing all placed points in a particular view can be done by pressing the red X. Once the points have been placed, select the OK button to align the model to the CT scan. The model can be hidden or viewed by pressing or unpressing the visible checkbox as well as the model outline by pressing or unpressing the model outline checkbox. It is helpful to determine the accuracy of the model importation by looking at the model outline in the 2D views and how approximate and close it is to the teeth. If additional positioning modification is required, press Adjust Model Position Manually button to activate a widget in the 3D view. The widget can now be used to move the model in any direction or to rotate or pivot the model. Once the model has been aligned to the desired location, press again Adjust Model Position Manually to hide the widget. The software can automatically do an initial placement of the model by using the Auto option. Select the draw type, select Auto, and press the Align button. If additional placement modification is necessary, the Points option or the Adjust Model Position Manually option can be used as previously demonstrated. If an STL model is exported from the software, modified, and then re-imported, the direct option can be used to position the modified STL model correctly in the CT scan. If a second STL model is being imported based on the positioning of the original STL model, the Align to Model button can be used. The software opens a dialog box asking to which model it should be aligned. In our situation, there's only one imported STL model. And then we can select the OK button. Double-clicking on a model automatically brings up the Surfaces panel. The Surfaces panel shows us the list of imported surfaces and allows us to change the color and to hide and unhide the model and the model outline. The opacity of the model can also be changed by selecting a model from the list and then using the transparency slider to modify the opacity. A model can be removed and deleted by pressing the red X 
next to the model.